God, you know, I was, before I went to bed, had about 400, I think, 18 subscribers, um, and I was hoping that maybe when I woke up, I'd be right at 420, and by God, I am right at 420, okay? Now, uh, a few days ago, uh, one of my uh, subscribers, and actually one good friend, man, um, he's definitely a great guy, man, definitely a great um, guy to talk to, if you guys ever see him, Patrick Randall, if you ever see him on Facebook, the guy's an awesome guy to talk to, so, um, just keep that in mind, um, he was like, man, when you get to 420, do a, a video on cannabis notes and stuff like that, and that was an awesome ass idea, I was like, man, that's a damn good idea, I only have one fragrance with cannabis, actually, I got two of them, the other one, I can't really smell the cannabis that much in it anyway, so I'm not gonna really bring that one out maybe i'll bring it out in a future video but what better way to maybe revisit a fragrance that i've done maybe like two three months ago okay and that was at the time when i probably only had about maybe 75 maybe 100 subscribers maybe not that many people have seen it yet but now that i've gotten more subscribers we'll revisit it now and that fragrance is baxter of california pacific cannabis the edp now, the price on this one, uh, the wifey actually bought me this. Um, I begged her for this thing. I was like, man, I need a fragrance that has that cannabis note. Now, the one that I originally wanted at the time was the CH Men Party Fever, but that thing was expensive as well. And, man, you can only find it on eBay. The, you know, the wifey's a little weary of eBay. You know, they scammed her once back in the early teens, but um, so she's been kind of a little iffy on that. So we passed on the party fever which i plan on getting eventually but man that thing is discontinued and so expensive but i do got this one and you guys this one is nice no i didn't have to go follow some guy in a cadillac and go you know secretly give him some money for this one this one you could easily purchase from the stores i think she got this one from macy's or nordstrom okay uh, pacific of cannabis that's baxter of california again it's the edp now, I forgot what the actual notes are. If you've seen my video before, you'll see it. It's like some green stuff in here. Definitely some of that herby stuff. Um, now, this one is not going to make you, as soon as you spray, you're not going to be like, oh my God, it smells like I've been smoking some weed. Because honestly, you're not going to want to do that. Especially, don't try to wear this at work. Now, with that being said, there are situations with this fragrance where when you get like these little breezes, you do smell this kind of like a weed cannabis kind of smell. Um, and I'm not sure if everyone else can smell it or is it something that only you're going to be able to pick up. But trust me, there is something in here that when you smell it, you're like, man, you almost smell like you ever go to that person's house that smokes and then when you leave you kind of smell that weed on you a little bit like and not like you know that you're, you're covered in smoke but even like days later you kind of get this little smell on you that like there's some weed this is exactly how this fragrance is okay this pacific cannabis i'm gonna actually waste the spray um this is the damn good fragrance for spring and summer you're gonna want to be outdoors again you're not gonna want to wear this at work Especially if you work in that nice office, you know, or maybe you work at one of those drug-free companies and, you know, you wear this, you know, maybe you did smoke something two days ago, but you know they don't do drug tests, but you wear this on an accident and then they're like, oh, we got to fucking drug test you. Now you're fucking fired. So don't do that. Wear this outdoors, especially spring, summertime, anytime the weather is above like 75 degrees, wear it around that time. High heat is very nice. When you sweat, you start smelling that little weedy smell a little bit more. But there's some citruses in here. I believe there are some, um, there's some green notes in here as well. <sighs> it's like a smell in a dime bag right here. No, there's, um, I definitely think there are some herbs in here as well. Could be the rosemary, sage, maybe some thyme in here. Uh, but again, I can definitely put the note right down somewhere on the video or just put it down in the comments below. 
but this fragrance is very nice. The performance, mm, I wish it could be better. It's about six to eight hours. Um, you would think for a hundred dollar bottle, it should last a little bit longer. It's not one of those um, things that, it's not one of those fragrances where you're really gonna have to rinse your hand off. It does, when it does fade away, it's fading away pretty fast. Um, two hours, you're gonna get some nice, decent projection and maybe they did it for that reason. Maybe they don't want people thinking you're actually smoking weed, but if that was the case, why make the fragrance? But um, this is a very nice fragrance. Even if you don't like the smell of weed, um, there's some people that just hate the smell of it. Um, this one, I actually really enjoy a lot. As you can see, I've definitely put dents in here now. This was because I did, um, when I started this journey, I did give um, some viewers a sample of this. If you guys want to try a sample of this, I'll definitely give you guys one. Just let me know. But again, it's really earthy. It's fresh. It's got that, like I said, it's got that faint 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 smell of cannabis weed cannabis THC whatever you want to call it it is definitely there um, now again it is not super duper potent you're not gonna go in somewhere and automatically someone's gonna think oh my god someone brought the shit to the party no it's not like that they're gonna have to kind of get close to you they're not gonna and they're not actually gonna smell it right away that weed. they're gonna have to kind of be around you a lot and then maybe as they kind of, you know, delve deeper into the fragrance, maybe they come across you a few times at the party. Maybe they come across um, you a couple times outdoors and then they start getting these little whiffs. Then they're going to start thinking, oh, my God, that guy's been smoking some shit. Um, but this is that. And again, we are at 420. What better way to start off the 420s than with the Pacific? cannabis again this is a damn good fragrance you guys again performance could be a little bit better projection i wish it was a little bit better but obviously they did it probably for those reasons that i just said maybe you don't want people to think you're smoking like i said but again again you will get those little faint smells of that weed in here this stuff is very good again it's probably cheaper now when i got this i think this was like a brand new bottle of fragrance okay this was like brand new just released um, that's why it was about $100 at Nordstrom. I think it's probably about uh, 60 bucks or so. Somewhere on eBay, you can probably get this for about 60 Somewhere else, you can probably get it for 60 But here you guys go. Pacific Cannabis. So for that 420th video subscriber, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed that. I'm definitely going to get out of here. It is a little too early for me. That's why you can hear my damn voice. Sounds like some damn Barry White today. But I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you guys did, hit the likes, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Peace out. Yeah.